Hey guys, Julissa here for Lifestyle Her and Global Grind TV. I'm so excited about today's shoot because we are catching up with Columbia recording artist Ravon and we have an exclusive interview with her and she's getting ready for BET's Music Matters performance. Let's go check her out. You're in the middle of getting glammed right now. So as an artist, how much say do you have in what you ultimately want to look like? I have a lot just because I think my music represents, you know, who I am. So I'm like, I need my, my look has to represent who I am, not what other people want me to look like. My music is, you know, a little harder, kind of edgy. I use profanity <laughs> just a little tiny bit. Like I demoed Energy for Carrie Hilson. I demoed Love Like This for Natasha Bedingfield. Stuff for Kelly Clarkson, Michelle Williams, Allison Irohato. So I did it for probably just about every artist you can think of. And then I started singing background for Brandy, Keisha Cole, and Carrie Hilson. Brandy. What had happened was <laughs> I had a best friend and I had fell in love with him. But he was with somebody else. <laughs> and he ain't even now. But I loved him. You know, work hard. I, I wanted to be an artist since I can remember. And I was in the music industry for like five years before it really happened for me. Um, but it's just definitely like about networking, you know, especially like in this industry, like entertainment industry, period. Like music, acting, you know, every, it's all about network. It's the name of the game. I just appreciate everybody's support and the love that I've been getting, you know, lately has just been incredible. And, you know, people are starting to really receive me as an artist and, and appreciate the music. And um, I feel like, the, you know, music is coming back around, you know, where it's not just all about the turn up music. I feel like people are like, that's all good. But at the same time, we, we want music that has substance. All done up, yes. looking beautiful. But well, before you go, yep. I need a little exclusive from you. That's for all of our Lifestyle Her and Global Grind TV viewers. I charge. <laughs> I charge for that. How about I do Best Friend? That would be great. Okay. Acapella. All right. I know you got that perfect 2020, baby. No need for them glasses or them contacts. So tell me why, tell me why, why can't you see? Every time you're kissing her in front of me, it hurts. I'm human, baby, it hurts. I'm not your fucking best friend. I've been sitting on this bench too long while you're playing with these basic fake chicks and come complaining when it all goes wrong. If you open your eyes and give sense a good try, I'll be all you need and more than a fucking best friend. Woo!